Welcome to Be Still and Know. I'm Jonathan Edwards, and this is our opportunity to hear what God is saying to us today. Philippians chapter 1, verse 6. I'm certain that God, who began the good work within you, will continue his work until it is finally finished on the day when Christ Jesus returns. I love the confidence with which Paul writes about the future. When you hear most people talking about the future, they're often hesitant and anxious, saying phrases such as, things just keep going from bad to worse, or what a terrible world to be brought up in. But Paul looked at the Philippians' future from God's perspective and was sure that God wouldn't let them down. Isn't it wonderful to know that our future is absolutely secure in God's hands? But that knowledge shouldn't cause us to become complacent. Later in this letter, Paul wrote about straining forward like an athlete so they could get to know the Lord better. One of the most valuable ways of getting to know God better is through reading the Bible. I hope these notes are helpful to you, but I'd always encourage you to read more and more of the Bible. Some might find it helpful to read through the Bible in one year, and having done so a few times in recent years, I strongly recommend this. But that's not for everyone, and it doesn't need to be. What matters is that we find effective ways of getting to know the Bible, and whether we read a lot or a little each day, to give time to listening to God. All scripture is inspired by God and is useful to teach us what is true and to make us realise what is wrong in our lives. It corrects us when we're wrong and teaches us to do what is right. Given that the only scripture available at the time was the Old Testament, you'll realise how much more blessed we are these days. If you want to become stronger in your Christian life, I encourage you to read the Bible, enjoy it, and get to know the Lord much better. So let me ask you a question. Are you looking to the future with confidence? Now let me pray with you. Thank you, loving Lord, that our future is entirely secure in your hands. Amen. I encourage you to join me every day for Be Still and Know here on Premier. Or you might like to join the thousands of people who listen to this on podcast, which is, of course, available at any time. Thanks for joining me and may God bless you today. <music>